Do we know maybe specifically what some of the produce uh, you mentioned, you know, lots of fruits and vegetables. Um, can mm -hmm. you share? Yeah, we do have a list. Uh, there is a document that was uh, created in the late 1920s. It was sort of a gardener's diary, if you will. And it detailed some of the day to day horticultural and agricultural activities that happened in the Vizcaya village. There were things farmed such as uh, sweet potatoes, corn, potatoes, cabbage, tomatoes, lettuce, you know, a lot of your standard crops were, were farmed here. And they also had an orchard, which featured a lot of tropical fruits such as oranges, sapodilla, um, mangoes, and, and so forth. And something interesting to note is that we do have evidence that David Fairchild uh, was active in some of the selections of uh, fruit trees uh, here at the Vizcaya Village, in addition to some ornamental crops as well. And uh, for those of you who don't know, David Fairchild uh, was really one of the preeminent botanists of the early 20th century and, and explored the world looking for uh, new crops and new varieties of crops uh, you know, while he was working for the USDA. And uh, Fairchild Tropical Botanical Garden is named after him as well. So um, it was a fairly wide variety of crops that were farmed here.